How are you? I'm good, George. How are you? Very well. Thanks for having me on. I appreciate it. I'm just waiting for my director. He's okay. adjusting camera. Okay, fantastic. I'm, gonna put, I'm waiting for my uh, hot dogs here. <laughs> We had hot dogs for supper last night. Ooh, that sounds very fancy. <laughs> yeah, wasn't it? <laughs> sure, I'm going to teach you how to make a real, truly good hot dog right now. Okay. Not that your hot dog wasn't nice. I'm just saying a little, scale it up a little bit. Okay. Okay. Be just a second here. Well, is the July 4th gathering happening at your place? Celebrity chef George Duran uh, has the grill going outside, and he's going to show us some easy dishes and beverages that will set off fireworks with your guests. Sliders with a twist, cool beverages to make your thirst, and always sides and, and grilling tips that will impress your guests. He'll even be sharing some of his favorite recipes. Hi, George. It's good to have you here. Thanks for having me on, Cheryl. So uh, what's new in grill technology to make it even simpler? Yeah, you know, when I like to get creative with my recipes, technology helps me a lot. For example, today I've made these sweet and spicy spiralized hot dogs, and they're cooked directly on this charbroil true infrared gas grill. Now, this grill gives everyone, regardless of their skill, the freedom to enjoy the entire grilling process. It has emitter plates that sit right above the flame, and that prevents any flare-ups. So that means no more burnt hot dogs, no more of those hot and cold spots on the meats that you put on the grill. The Charbroil True Infrared Grill disperses the heat evenly and it pretty much helps retain the flavor of everything you're cooking. So you have tastier burgers, more flavorful hot dogs, the best food you've ever grilled. Cool. So can you give us a twist on the traditional burger? Yeah, look at this. This is called the Roth Grand Cru Cheeseburger. It's all about the cheese, and I'm using Roth Grand Cru Cheese. Now, Roth cheeses are made uh, in Wisconsin but with artisan the artisan uh, uh, what's an artisan cheese made in Wisconsin using the freshest milk um, the varieties include Havarti Gouda naturally smoked Gouda you can visit rothcheese.com to find them all there I've also made a spicy mango slaw burger this is beautiful because it's not only on a burger you can also put it on a hot dog but I use Cholula hot sauce to add a ton of flavor and taste to this slaw without overpowering it you see some people are afraid of hot sauce is being too hot. Well, Cholula isn't. It's known for its flavorful taste, what I call a flavor forward hot sauce. No artificial ingredients or preservatives. You just got to look for that iconic wooden cap at Ch with the Cholula hot sauce. Yeah, there's a difference between spicy and hot. <laughs> there's no doubt about it. And this is actually flavorful. That's what you're really looking for with this hot sauce. So what are some easy sides? Yeah, you know, one of the things that I really like to do is to serve as a side or even to get the people kind of nibbling on while the grill is getting hot are pop chips. See, pop chips are never fried. They're always real. My favorite flavors being the deep ridges with that big crunch. Uh, flavors like buffalo ranch and cheddar sour cream. You can also try the classic varieties that are sea salt and barbecue. So these guys have half the fat and fewer calories than the traditional fried chips. And of course, no artificial ingredients. A great way to pair it with a dip or even, as you said, a side dish for the burgers or the hot dogs. Very simple, very easy and very, very flavorful as well. And even at a barbecue, sometimes you've got some people that are diehard coffee lovers. So oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. It doesn't have to only be coffee. It could be hot chocolate as well. Well, this is Compresso's Milk Frother. It comes with a premium stainless steel pitcher. and It's a cafe quality frother. So at a touch of a button, you can make cold froth milk for iced coffee or hot froth milk for cappuccinos and lattes, flat whites. You, but you can also create by adding chocolate chips directly to it. You can create some rich hot chocolate. Add chocolate chips directly to that Compresso. I'm telling you, you're going to be the life of the party with that. 
Yeah, that sounds good. That's something I always have on hand, too, is chocolate chips. <laughs> Very, and that's perfect. You add the milk. It's literally simple as that. You add the milk, press the button right there on the compresso. It beeps when it tells you to put the chips in there. You put the chips in there, and suddenly you have instant very uh, uh, decadent hot chocolate. Very cool. So uh, do you have any other tips for us or, or do you know where we can go to learn more? Absolutely. All these recipes, I have tips, recipes, and more information on everything I've spoken about today at dailylounge.com. Okay. Well, George, it's always a pleasure. Thanks so much for joining us today. Happy Fourth of July, Cheryl. Thank you. And we'll be back.